Hey, what's up, guys? Joshua One Two Three Four Eight Two here, bringing you some Dark Souls gameplay. Um, so my friend was nice enough to send me some gameplay on this. He told me about the game and stuff, and I thought it would be something fun for us to do on my channel. And um, he also said that it's really frustrating and you die a lot. So. Let's get started with uh, some gameplay. Alright, so we just skip past the um, intros and stuff and the customization of your character. And now we're getting to some actual gameplay here. And um, looks like we are a male warrior who is beating up red zombie skeleton people and running over their corpses. Uh huh. And he's having a conversation with the wall. Nice, nice. Okay, so just gonna walk up these stairs after reading this message here. So, beating up some more red zombie people. And, um, I actually have no idea what's going to happen, so, um, I'm just voicing over. I haven't any done, actually done any actual gameplay of this video, so I don't know what to expect, so it'll be a surprise to you guys and me. Ooh, bonfire. <laughs> So I guess these bonfire things are like checkpoints, I guess, that you can rest at or, or re return to after you die. So if you have any um, tips or hints that you want to tell us, just leave it in the comments. And if you like this game, make sure to hit the like button. And if you want to see more of um, my channel's content, then make sure to subscribe. And it looks like we're at another bonfire already. I guess there are a lot of these. And um, so my friend Evan, he just posted some Minecraft gameplay videos the, the first day. And um, so we're going to be covering a lot more variety of gameplay. We're going to do some Xbox. We're going to do some PC. Um, maybe even other stuff like... We did the advent some adventure quest things, and so we're trying to have more variety than just Clash of Clans or just tablet, PC. Um, so we're really spreading it out. And looks like this one has a bow. Okay, looks like the game is pretty easy so far, I guess. And um, definitely suggest any other uh, Xbox games that you might want me or my friend Hunter or Evan or anybody, any one of us to play. Because, I mean, we're um, definitely looking for a more variety of games. And it'd be nice if you guys could suggest. It looks like we're talking to this guy, so he's saying, I'll die soon, then I'll lose my sanity. I wish I had something of you. You and I were both undead. Hear me out, will you? Interesting. So it looks like we're undead. What is your decision? Regrettably, I have failed my mission, but perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family, Thou who art undead, to the, the, in thine exodus from the undead. It's going too fast. And when thou rengeth in the bell of awakening the fate of the undead, thou shalt dwell in the... Okay, if, if you guys are not able to keep up like me, you can just like pause it as you go along. So I'll try and read as fast as I can. And end as fast, okay, I guess that's it. So we get a key and a flash thing. I would hate to harm you after death, so go now. Alright, so it looks like 
We're good to go here. And we kill him. All right. Nice. <laughs> Can you go there? No. Just walk up these stairs and kill some more red zombies. And it looks like we're on our way going through this gate here using the key, I believe. So, just gonna walk around, explore everything. Seriously, what are those things? Um. Okay, so just gonna kill some more of those guys. I guess right now it's just risking these red guys with bows and swords, and sometimes they don't have anything, and maybe an occasional shield. With a is that a knight or is that a zombie? Can't tell. Oh yeah, that's a knight. Oh dang, <laughs> dang, that was an epic kill. It's so funny how if you walk on top of them, they just like spaz out. And it looks like we're gonna go through another portal. With oh. Lovely, a giant potato sack. Oh, why is he so fat? Where are we? I, I have no idea. Where the heck are we? How are we going to beat this guy? I don't know. Maybe if we hit enough pots, we can get a super ability or something. That That's just to show how, how little I know about this game, crying out loud. Um, I guess the little uh, Aslam demon with that little health bar, I guess that's, that's health. And let's just see if my friend can beat him. Alright, so looks like we're gonna smash some more pots and hopefully we'll take him out. His health bar is at about half, so we're doing pretty good, I guess. I honestly have no clue what no clue what I'm talking about. Alright, so we're gonna slice him up a bit. He's doing some damage. And he's going to hit the floor in rage. And it looks like we're going to need to strategically kill him after, after he hits the ground. I guess we can attack him from the back or something. I don't know. Um, dang, he actually looks kind of scary. <laughs> dang. Alright. Looks like his health is at like, what, 25% left? Oh, look at that health bar! <laughs> Dang. How is that even possible? Alright. I should just not die. And. Yes! Nice. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so now we continue on our journey. Opening doors and killing monsters. Alright. So the objective is to now go straight ahead. 
Dun 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 Ooh, cutscene. Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be chosen to be eaten by a giant bird. Alright. To leave the undead asylum in pilgrimage. Alright, so we're in the undead asylum. To the land of the ancient lords. Lord Dran. Alright. So now we got a little bit more information on this, I guess. So that's the end of the cutscene, I guess. Now, hopefully, we'll get some more game. Oh, never mind. Never mind. So just gonna fire on this castle here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh huh. And we're back. Is that a bonfire? Cool. It's a bonfire. And there's more dead people. Yay! So now I guess we can do more things at the at the bonfire. We can like level up and stuff or whatever. So we're gonna increase some stats. Okay. It looks like we're set. Let's see what this guy is saying. Well, what do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess, fate of the undead, right? Well, you're not the first. So there are others or something. But there's no salvation here. You'd have done better in, to rot in the undead asylum. But too late now. Well, since you're here, let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. Whatever that is. One's up above in the undead church, the other is far, far below in the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both and something happens. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on, but I have a feeling that won't stop you. So off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? To this accursed land of the undead? Ha 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 ha. Alright, so, um, that about is it for the video. That's all I have time for today. Um, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.